Hi everybody, welcome back to Warhammer 40,000 Drug Trader. It, we've just done uh, down here the inheritance thing. Uh, we've had a fight up here, into the liege, a fight here, inheritance. And now we're going over to the shadow area, whatever it's called. So, let's go. Shadow quarters, that's it. We rest in here. Is that a uh, hand solo kind of smuggler character, female one? Um, some gangs and the rumours down in this area. So let's have a look. There'll probably be lots of fights. Very confusing layout. Not for me, it will be. We also get about verticality and things like these. Oh, sorry. Right, let's get carry on. Go, go, go. Do that for. Get up to percent. Look, trader, I would like to remind you about Reverend Hieronymus' request. Let's just search for a potential cultist den. Football shell. You lay down by something. What? No. She shakes her head and rubs the temples tightly. We do that a lot here. Oh, she's rock trader. Being here on football is difficult for me. It's a minor personal weakness, but I'm as ready as ever to fight. I have no effect on my combat skills. You better not do. You're the one who hits things. I would like to know whatever this personal weakness is. Members of my crew now have secrets for me. You're right, I'll explain. It's about the circumstances of my arrival on football. I wasn't born in Expanse. I was sent here to be a guardian of a reliquary. Well, I got that, yeah. In the conversation you had with the... Iwan was... what's his name? When my ship became caught in a warp anomaly, and although it lasted only days for those on board, decades have flown by in view space. Ouch. That the one we heard about, previously, a couple of episodes ago. Each fucking symbol there, that's not good. And at last I arrived on foot for it, felt like I'd been erased from time. No one was waiting for me on this side of the wall. People who were supposed to greet me, me by my ignorant wife, or had died. Reliquary that should have been mine to safeguard, instead of being taken under protection by Reverend Arambus and his brethren. They were more up to the task. I had no need of my help. So you felt quite like useless and not resigned. Football became my cage. I didn't know who I was or what purpose I had here. The way back to Calixus seemed like another trap. The info to find a ship headed there, I said that my order, they too would have lived decades without me at that point. Whenever I'm reminded of those months spent on footfall, it feels like I'm falling into a pit. I hope the dreams of cultists turn out to be true. I can't wait to prove my, with my bolt of that. That, but the world and the pair of them need me. How and why did your stay in football come to an end? Something must have changed. Yes, a sign. Almost a portent, showing the right path. It's not something I speak of like this on the street, in this den of malice. Let's be on our way. What I'll say is that footfall, I met the Lady Theodore and joined her. That was the end of my languishing in this place. But you were ill for a long time. Oh, that could have been in between. You could have gone off, had that lack of judgment, got ambushed, almost dead, and then joined up here. You know, footfall better than me. Do you think the rumours of heretics are true? There was a time when I've said there was likely a fabrication. One can say many things about the Casabalica mission. The other shady operators are footfall. Even those thugs are loyal to the Emperor, though they mercilessly exterminate the outright heretics in their territory. But now, heretics have launched an open attack on the Rogue Trader's ship. A member of your dynasty, Conrad the Voitvia, has turned out to be one of them. And footfall itself is sinking deeper and deeper into madness. These times of strife, and willing to believe in heretics, who are open before their dark rituals and brazenly mock their dens with sacrilegious symbols. Let's keep going. Hey, this is how he's done. We should deal with this. Deal with what? What have you spotted? The 
Energy spells there. Rising Sun Symbol appears to be oddly repulsive, even sinister. New Dawn, Old Dawn, Final Dawn, yes, maybe. Why are your recollections of this blue? The more you talk about it, I used to take my weapon and wander this area, participate in the account of the mutiny of Andy. That's what I was. used to grass. Uh, Jaunt hard to see how the slums are. It wasn't time to destroy these tiles, they were purposely cried out with purpose and intelligence. Is that to get air growing or was it to um some kind of that kind of person and stuff? This ocular implant was a worthwhile investment. So mind trigger. Now I've noticed that. But it blow up if I touch it. But there's no way to defuse it. Is there money to be made? Acquisition is possible. Music. Is this the um, path to the evil people, the cultists, all of the symbols in this street? Yes. Let's have a look around first. I always have a backup plan. I guess some better loot. Oh, I might level up. What's the level like? No, I'm not going to level up for the team. And this again. Come see you. Not to get flamed. There was a flame like that, you idiot. You almost, almost refueled here. I'll show you how it's done. I'm just not feeling it anymore, that's all. The guy's pretty much a cinder now. It's not my fun when there's a light flashing around. Why we took you up? It's like two hundred fucking power. Okay. Not so good. Lamer's got to go. Folks, easy to kill. Arsonist, not so much. Ember. 
about 200. Okay. Right, so let's get you there. Let's just get cast the Me. people. If you insist, get Lord Captain. Going up. I'll do it. None can escape the Emperor's judgment. Faith right. without deeds is worthless. I'll do it. Each strike is a prayer. Well, you should be able to do that now. Two have killed. What weapons? What weapons back? I will not! I don't like... Oh. I don't like... Oh, no AP, that's fine. I can do it first thing next turn. She could have moved, but um, I will buff. Gentle. I'll make it happen. It means I can't get to fire again. But I can't use it. Right then, Pascal. Let's get everybody in that. Anybody, really. I'm not accustomed to being boarded around. Never tough that hits or not. No, it doesn't. That is strange. What did you think? This is 
really weird with the targeting. That was this. Why is it not targeting people properly? This is weird. Oh, if I may. I don't get this. Like it's not doing them. I'm losing points and stuff. A job for the serves. Me, if you insist, Again, Lord Captain. Nothing. What else should do anything? There's no test being made or anything. Good morning. We'll do. Doctor. Patience. Anything is. That is not my destiny. I'm not so sure. Not the scryer's job. Okay, let's see. Swap to weapons in the shot. Shoot. Can she shoot anybody? Which is why I'm the open um, let's go here. They who discern the future on the battlefield. No can do. That is not my destiny. It says I can shoot you. from there. Yeah, and that's like those this way. I'm not so sure. Not this Grier's job. That was him. movement in the Empyrean. We don't want a bit extra dash. That's not great, but it's worth it. Might be our gentle. Eighty six. As the Emperor Without commands, first. I act. No, I must forgot then. Just for the week. Eighty-six. Eradicated. Oh. I'll do it. Faith without deeds is worthless. I'll do it. Ah! Then I... Doubt is for the weak. You can escape the Emperor's judgment. That is not the Emperor's will. 
if we do that then. And we turn that up. Jesus. I won't stand for it. Contact, why not? Is that a stun grenade? It was a stun grenade. I'm burning. I think these might all die. Make it happen. Let's have some damage. And that went down because the damage didn't do. Um. Who, if not me? I will do my duty. Okay, let's get people out of that fire, I guess. I know what is to come. Battlefields are always drowned in scarlet. I'm not accustomed to being ordered around. Do not dare ask. Still stunned. Okay. Now I'm afraid buffed. not. Uh, if I buffed. may. Yeah. If only that were possible. Stop it! Find you. On it. 
It will be done. Indeed. Damage. I thought it was like 20 damage. Plus the advantage, fucking hell. I'll take that. Wow. Um, have Lars next. He can have loads and loads of um, melee attacks. These two are going to die because they're stunned and can't move. Burning to death. She's probably going to die as well. Um, we'll do that next turn. Just a minor setback. Uh, let's do some Victory damage here. Is well struck. Perhaps a sworn enemy. I will do my duty. I do do it for yet. Like this. No matter the cost. And just keep chugging away. It will be done. Indeed. Until the half done. I will do my duty. Any 
anything is. As the Emperor eradicated. Faith without deeds is worthless. Maybe two left. Well, one left, it's just him. That one's moved there. God Emperor, move through me! Be the fire in my heart! Oh, beauty. Well, I only a couple of wounds. Oh. Into there and head trauma. She always gets head trauma. Those grenades fucked me up. So, okay, let's. Nah, I've got a bit of experience. Not a massive amount. Um, I will lead us to fortune. You can't do I'm it. listening. You can heal. Oh no, it's waste. House Orcelio thanks you. I have to go back to the ship for that. Integrity factor So yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go back to the ship. Let me loot first. Then go back to the ship, I guess. Knowledge is eternal. Scrap chamber. Keep your eye on the prize. I'm level below, is it? Is it? No, it's just here. Never have fire plus carapace. Plus two deflection and twenty against fire. Well, it's immune to the burning. Plus ten against melee. That's not bad actually. Thunderhammer. I think they both could be for Abelard. Okay. Read this. He's waiting for you thing. I think I might have to go back to this ship to get rid of that because that's really. Back to the ship here, I'll come back down again. Info. He's waiting for you. You know the place, so be there one time. A turn can be seen from the entrance to the Adeptus. Make sure some gawker doesn't see where you're going. A turn can be seen. Maybe it's like a, a alleyway or something. Uh, hmm. So you, you have that turned. Stuck and over. 17 pushes enemies away. All creatures. Shuffle. Push me four cells. Definitely more damage. Chain axe is more than a sword. And it as well. Mm. Okay. Good that. It's got that arc rifle. Case. Uh now this. Okay, this has got better dodge. So, and 36 is damage reduction. Better deflection. Oh no. Ah no, it's only got this fire bless cow, but it's only got deflection against fire. Hmm. 
Might be worth just hanging around though. Just in case. If I come up against more fire, it might be useful for them. Let's see if I can get Cassia healed up. So I'll pause this. You haven't seen these loading screens, do you? So I'll pause that. Like, if anything happens in between, obviously. Well, on the way back to the ship, <coughs> my is there. I had to come back through the, uh, the docks, couldn't go straight to the ship. From when the figure turns to you, he looks on Kallax, interrogated the Order of Xenos, bows his head respectfully, Lord Captain. I did interrogate him, I was surprised. Did you perchance leave something in your cabin? Not at all, first of all, but alien. Not in the habit of leaving the trail, I think if you're concerned. Greetings, interrogator. To what do I owe the pleasure of this latest visit? Only our mutual duty to humanity. It's my duty that demands that I disturb your peace once more. I was able to contact my mentor and report the tragic events that transpired on my Kakma novice. I also received some information from my agents regarding the movements and actions of the enemies of humanity, including the Xenos that we assumed were involved in the theft of the star. According to their findings, the new th threat that now hangs over other worlds is done yours, Lord Captain. Cater's throat begins in a pointedly official term. By the order of Lord Inquisitor Xavier Calcazar, whose duty is to stand sentinel over the Quorum's expanse, the rogue trader of Houghton Valencius is to take on board the agent of the Most Holy Inquisition, to provide escort support and deeds great and small that serve to safeguard the territories of the Quorum against its enemies. This decree is effective immediately until announcement and remains in effect until decided otherwise by His Excellency Calcazar. Dear Swiss Spirit of Wardwall, all I've got from it is that. All I've got from it is that ridding ourselves of this snitch won't be easy. Can't really say no, can I? So this human then ever so slightest, if not wanting anyone else to see if he shakes his head. What exactly causes me to rejoin my crew? Of course, it's the activity of humanity's enemies including the cult of the final door. In my absence, the situation at the Quarant's expanse has changed. I have received an exhaustive report from my agents. This heresy has taken root in the region where the long, one Valencius rules lie. Probably you already know about the fate of the industrial world of Kiava Gamma. If not, then I'll share the details I know, but not here. And to the talk on board, we will not be overheard. I, Rogue Trader, Gentleman of Von Valencius, welcome the agent of the Golden Throne aboard my ship and take on responsibility of assisting him in the fight against the evil threat of battle. Don't say that, I'm gonna get shit. Gives a reserve nod, man's to be fitting the righteous servant of the Emperor. Duty has brought you aboard the Rogue Trader ship once more, and she shots us the Emperor's will. Welcome back, interrogator. Thank you, sister. I need to be travelling on the Dressed Demptus or Soritas. Excellent Kallax. Cassie's voice is brimming with genuine joy, but she merely hides behind a facade of high-worn primness. Which you are with us once more. I do hope you find time to finish our conversation about the literary works of Conhard of the Blessed. We'll make every effort, Lady Orsa. I must deliver this to you, pulls out a silver letter. The Lord Inquisitor specified that the contents of this envelope will be your eyes only, and ask you to read it as soon as you have time. That's everything for the time being. I hope to the ship or do still have business a footfall. Whatever the case, I can either wait for you on board or accompany you as part of your retinue. At least they'll level up on the one. Okay. Okay, let's have a look at this letter then. May the Empress Faith will forever remain in the light of his favour. <coughs> in the first express my condolences on the tragic death of the most honourable Theodore von Valencius. Nevertheless, I was later to learn the warrant of rogue traders may pass to a worthy and promising heir. 
These words are not hollow compliments, rather the Inquisition's official opinion of your person. Okay, rather worrying. As fate would have it, you have taken the reins of the Von Valencia's dynasty, and at our most dire. The grim portents of dark events are come to come are servicing throughout the Corona's expanse. I have been duty bound to become the first sentinel who seeks the approaching threat. And I hereby alert you that is indeed coming. Our loyalty and resolve will be tested. People such as you and I will become the pillars that will unite the Emperor's frightened children and inspire them to fight back. And so I greet you, my dependable ally, and assure you of my favour. From now on, you are a trusted friend within the holy orders of the Emperor's Inquisition and a receptive confidant on whom you can rely. Should the dark times ahead require you to make questionable choices, have no doubt that such an incident will be examined in an exceedingly temperate fashion that rules out the most radical forms of judgment. I have faith in your success, my partnership, and thank you for your contribution, both past and future. Lord Inquisitor Xavier Carcazar. Okay. That's not bad, they're going to give me a couple of buys. But only a couple. Not too extreme. I always keep my options open. So, while I'm loading, I'll pause again. Another cutscene. Seems to load it. Well, Captain, the inspection of the ship's system is complete. The tech priests are reporting the machine spirits are calm and satisfied. Everything is ready for onward travel. Except there's an issue you must be made aware of. Cassia makes a nervous gesture, just an endowment over her third eye, and he stood the records left by the vessel's previous navigator. I wanted to double check the route to Dragonus, but discovered that it does not match the one recorded in the atlas. There's more than a minor warp fluctuation. The route has been wiped out, and no longer used for travelling. To make matters worse, it's hard to check in the past from the Atlas, one after another. It's all the same thing everywhere. The warp is roiling with the ominous storm. Boasting their vivid and screaming colours will not hinder our movement, but all previous knowledge is now utterly useless. Magenta angrily chops the air beside her palm. Warp storms are their enemies, just like heretics and demons, a shame they can't be dispersed with a flame or a bolter. Now we can be certain that the problems with the astropathic communication in the Coen's expanse are no coincidence. There is a warp disturbance in the radio character, just swallowing messages and disrupting familiar rooms. This means you need to locate the key worlds of the Volum of Valance's protector as soon as possible. Talking about Janus, Dargonus, and Kiaragana. Chart a new route so that can reach the restoring control will be the necessary next step. What's the consequence of losing contact with these, wor with these worlds? world and provide a connection to its neighbouring systems and the current expanse infrastructure can rely only on itself. And the capabilities are often limited. For example, Janus does not have a fleet of its own. Pirates, cultists, heretics, demons, anyone could prey on the helpless planet. The loss of communication is a threat to your position. A world trader with no protectorate to back them up, one that goes weaker by the day. Rock's master is entirely correct, says Ermelard. No rogue trader, John, gentleman Sir Von Valencius. The successor to Theodore von Valencius, one of the most influential women this side of the moor. You're also new to the business and governing. Many will doubt your competence and try to carve up your protectorate so they can snatch your peace for themselves. Important to show your potential allies and foes that you'll control the situation, which is why the sooner we reclaim this world lost rules, the better. About Janus. The surface of Janus was altered extensively, so the planet be designated an agri world. It's a powerful food base, capable of supplying diversion and protectorate, and exporting provisions to the outer worlds at the same time. Then there's owes much responsibility to the Governor House of Fayat. Under its leadership, the world has grown ever more prosperous year after year, securing shipments and taxes while keeping the workforce, workforce tightly controlled. Kyogana? Industrial world Kyogana is being managed by the Governor House of Kaprak, and supplies your protector with rare mineral resources. Officially, the planet features an adaptive mechanicus manufactorium that processes materials and prepares them for shipment. I testify that Kyovagama is a world marked by the omnisized patronage. Its grace, the manufactoriums, with the colony inhabited by committed and industrious machine spirits. Angus coughs. 
Mistress Tolliver neglected to mention that the Kiava Gamma Manufactorium also supplies heavy machinery from the forage harvesters to vessel system to vessel systems and components. A blood test sign Hendrix displayed commendable knowledge about the world's manufacturing capability and colours. Just to be of service. What do we need to know about Dargonus? Against the heart and soul of your protectorate, it is where the main administrative resources and storage facilities are. So is the Von Valancy's palace. If you'd like to know, is it where you publicly accept the title of rogue trader? Argonus is a major administration hub that moves the cargo fleet and keeps track of finances. Abelard, what do you think? Which world should we deal with first? Strokes his beard for a second. We discovered that Agri World supply potential was some, something none of your servants can do without sustenance. The importance of basic supplies should not be underestimated. It's to be fought for as current beautiful state. On the other hand, we're concerned about the rumours concerning Kiara Gemma. There have been no problems in Jans for many years, but something is very wrong with the industrial world right now. The lane might cost us the entire planet. I trust that that would explain the capital world. Losing it would make us a laughing stock rather than the dynasties. Besides, the loss of chronicles and ledgers will spell a geographic catastrophe. The all three systems are equally vital to the protectorate. They force you to decide which we brought into the fold before the rest. Very well. Our course is clear. My officers have any other issues that require immediate attention. That is all, Lord Captain. The vessel and the crew await your instructions and ready to port the part of footfall immediately should you decide. No, I'm just here to heal up. Oh, I've got another big chunk of experience there. To, to heal her. And there's something that I'm cogitating on this level. I'll find it another time. But for now, I'll pause again and go back, back down to where we were. See you in a sec.